Hey guys, it's your boy, the next big thing back again with another video for you guys today. And I want to wish you all a very Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, Happy Kwanzaa, whatever you celebrate. I just want to say that to you guys. And also, sorry, I haven't uploaded in about two months or something like that, I feel, or a month, I don't know. But anyways, this is what I got for Christmas 2017. I did this video last year. It did actually pretty well. It got like six almost 70 views and normally i get like 10 views per video but this year it was big but it wasn't big as last year like last year i had like shirts figures cards like dvds i had a lot but this year it's not that much like compared to other years but yeah let's get started so i have stocking of course so this i it's a mini like basketball game I don't know. It looks pretty fun, to be honest. It looks really, really, really fun. So, that's that. Next. Got some gum. Can never have enough gum. <laughs> toothbrush. Gotta always remember your toothbrush. Gotta brush your teeth. Be squeaky clean. Oh, this, this stuff. This one's good. It's the tap out. Body spray line. Defy has John Cena right there. The WWE logo. I got like I saw this before. I'm like that smells good, and I got it. So I'm happy about that. Next, we have two boxes of the Life Savers gummies. These are very underrated candies. You guys should try that. Next, you have the Welch's fruit snacks that you get like in your uh, that you can put in your stocking. I like I love Welch's. They're the best. What else is there? Oh, so I'm really happy I got this on DVD because this is a great DVD to add to the collection. It is TLC 2017. There's the back. This is this is probably the only reason I'm going to actually watch this. The AG Styles Film Battle Match. I know it's on the network, but what you going to do? Um, anything else in here? Got some gingerbread men. You gotta love gingerbread men. What can I say? Anything else really at all that, um, anything? I don't think so. I may be wrong. Oh. Now, you can't see them, obviously, right now, but I got Rudio socks. That is, I, can't, I can't hold my leg up like a girl like that. But anyways, let's go into the cards. I got two different series, one box of each. I was really happy with both. So first, we have the NXT Blaster Box. This set is one of my favorites they made. Even though, like, for this, I think you get the Hobby Box. They're all, I mean, they're all just, like, relics and stuff. I'm not complaining, because normally they give you a really good one. And this one, I'm not mad about. This is a former WWE NXT Cruiserweight Superstar from NXT TakeOver Dallas. Austin Aries, a double. Numbered. 95 of 99 not focusing let's try again and yeah, not focusing but also an Aries matte relic this is awesome next I got <laughs> I'm really excited for this one I got a um then now forever value box now you don't get guaranteed hits in this you can buy this like I got this from my aunt very cheap but if you get this, it's not guaranteed to get a hit whatsoever. Like, you can buy this, get zero hits. But, I personally have the jackpot. So, for autographs, there's a lot of different variants. You can get AJ Styles. Like, look. You can get John Cena, Sting, Dean Ambrose, AJ Styles, Seth Rollins, Sasha Banks. I know this because I've seen the checklist. You can also get the last kicker, Becky Lynch. But this, I'm really happy about. Now, you guys know Kerr Hawkins is my favorite, and I have an autographed card of him. But this tops it. Like, I, I love Kerr Hawkins. I love him to death. But this is a lot better. It is numbered 36 of 50. Roman Reigns autographed card. This was awesome. Now, the funny thing was, when I was opening, I'm just going through. I looked up, and I, I moved one card. I didn't even care. I just looked down. I see the blue ink, and I was marking out so much. The Roman Reigns autographed bronze bordered. 
numbered 36 of 50. This was awesome. Like, I was marking out when I opened it. <laughs> Next, move on to Pop Vinyls. First, in my opinion, the most overrated superstar in wrestling history, Bret the Hitman Hart. I know I was on Muscle Man Malcolm's video for unpopular wrestling opinions, and I said, uh, Bret Hart is the most overrated wrestler, in my opinion, and he did nothing in history. And he was just flipping out, like, whose man's is this? And he's like, oh, he's probably smoking. <laughs> I thought it was funny, but yeah. The most overrated man, Bret Hart. Next is the man who's going to defeat Kenny Omega at Wrestle Kingdom 12, Chris Jericho, who is going to be the new IWGP champion in a matter of days, ladies and gentlemen. Chris Jericho. This is an awesome Funko Pop to add to the collection. Great Funko Pop. Next, the final Funko Pop. This is the man who I think should be WWE champion until WrestleMania. It's, it's AJ Styles. The, this is one of my favorite Funko Pops they've ever come out with the Aegis House. It's really awesome. Next, we're going on to video games. Yes, video games. Now, the big reason why I didn't get a lot... Like, this is like a really good amount, but like a lot of this was from like my grandparents and stuff. But I got the Xbox One S. And you gotta get a game go along with it. WWE 2K18 Deluxe Edition. This is sick. Now... Obviously, you have the little paper right here. You have the codes on the back, but I'm not going to show them to you guys. Because, you know, um, I want to use my game. <laughs> but the 2K18 Deluxe Edition. Let's just see what it comes with. I'm going to make sure to hide the code. I get both versions of Kurt Angle. I get Rob Van Dam, Batista, and two versions of John Cena. And then I get a season pass to go along with this. This will be awesome to use. Obviously, comes with the manual, blah, 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 seizures, blah, 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 who cares, but yeah, the WWE 2K18 Deluxe Edition, I was, oh, it was great. So now we're going to go on to figures, the last part of this video, I gotta say, I, I love, I love these figures. A lot of them are new, because normally I get like older figures, like last year, I got an Undertaker figure that was like five months old, but this year, like the oldest figure in this is about like a year old, but the rest are like, between like four and now like in time span. So let's go with the oldest figure. It's the WrestleMania 31 Triple H figure. Now I have a basic Triple H which is really really old. I have an elite figure that's old. But I'm happy to have a newer Triple H figure to add to the collection. This Triple H is I personally think now I haven't opened this yet. I may open it. I probably will because I'm not going to meet him. I don't want to meet him. Well, I want to meet him, but like I'm not going to get him to sign this if I was going to get him to sign something. But the Triple H figure, it comes with like, the Terminator. For me, it's Terminator. So, yeah. Triple H figure. Next, let's go on. Well, let's just go on to his wife. Steph Elite Series 50, Stephanie McMahon. This is a awesome figure. This is a great, great, great Stephanie McMahon. Now, I have I have the other Elite she got when she was doing the Steph, Steph, Steph movement. But this, I feel like it's better because it's from a WrestleMania 32 entrance. This is, like, pretty much the... Like, if you're going to get a Stephanie McMahon figure from, like, her wrestling attire, you're going to want to get this one because this was awesome. And the, battle, the new Battle Pack one was really, really cool. Next... Let's go on to this figure. Now, I'm not going to go from oldest to newest, because if I did that, then it would ruin it. But next is from the NXT Series 2 Elite line. And this is one half of my favorite tag team that came out of NXT. I think so? Yeah. It is the Dash Wilder NXT figure with the NXT Tag Team Championship. Now, funny thing about this. But with this and the Scott Dawson, it's the only way you can get the NXT Tag Team Championship belts. Which I think is crazy, because then you gotta go hunting for that. And if you live in, like, the UK, Canada, or, like, some other countries, you can't get it without, like, going on eBay or something like that and paying, like, 40 extra bucks. But, yeah, this is Dash Wilder Elite. I may open this, but, like, I don't know. I, I, I like, I like the, that figure. Next. You know what today is, guys? Rusev Day! Elite Series 46, Rusev. This is 
awesome. This was awesome. Because personally, Rusev is my is probably like my third favorite on SmackDown Live, especially what he's doing right now with Rusev Day. Rusev is just awesome. The 12 days of Rusev all the way. So, Rusev right there. Next, um, let's go on to, now, the rest of these are all an Elite Series 52, one of the newest Elite Series. I know they, like, have Elite Series 56 for pre-order on Brinkside Collectibles, but this is, like, I'd rather, because this is, like, my favorite Elite, I'm not joking when I say this, this is my favorite Elite Series they've come out with in the, so far. So, this next one, Elite Series 52. My favorite member, I think. Yeah, favorite member of the New Day, uh, honestly. It is Kofi Kingston. He comes with a unicorn. He comes with a unicorn horn right there. He comes with the entrance jacket. And, like, if you look right there, the boots are... Really, like, if you go on to Tommy Toy Travels, go check him out. If you're not subscribed to him already, go subscribe to him. But if you look at this guy's opening, like, 100-plus wrestling figures... The one he just did recently. This, these boots are awesome. Like, if you see them out of the box, these are awesome. So, Kofi Kingston Elite Series 52 figure. Um, let's go with this one, because this one's probably my, no, it's not my favorite one. But it is, it's a new day. Yes, it is. It is Xavier freaking Woods. Comes with a trombone. I really like, honest to God, I really love it when he comes with the trombone, because I play trombone. In high school, I majoring in that. If you can't tell, performing arts instrumental, but I major in my instrument. So come with the trombone. It really like hits my heart, hits home. And come with a little unicorn horn too, the little entrance jacket. Now I no, I opened the other Xavier Woods because it's really an awesome figure. The other one that came with the trombone, but this one I'm, I think I'm gonna keep the Kofi Kingston and Xavier Woods. I think I'm, I may keep a mint on card, but maybe not the Xavier Kofi Kingston because I don't have a Kofi Kingston Elite. But this really cool. Last two figures. This first one. Now, the funny thing is, my mom knows this person's sister. Honest to God. And I just think this is really awesome. So, I got this so I can meet him at Legends of the Ring, hopefully, in June. It is the D... Wait, hold on. Is this damage? I feel like it's damage. No, but it's the Elite... D low brown with the European championship. This is a great figure. Something flying around there. Probably stand. But yeah, this is Elite D low brown. This is like probably one of the best figures you can get right now. Especially with the European title. The European title does not come with a lot of figures. Let's be honest. So this is well, a really good one. Last figure. Now, there is a two figures I need to get in Elite Series 52 to, to, for my first time ever to complete a set. Now, this is not the Braun Strowman or the Ken Shamrock. Yeah, this is my favorite Elite from the series. It's the Seth freaking Rollins in the Tron, like, yellow-green-ish. Now, there is some, like, paint mistakes on it, but I'm really keeping this for mint on cards, because I want to meet Seth Rollins, because I know people are like, oh, I'm going to buy the, the, the white Seth Rollins, the one with the white attire, but personally, I feel like I want to get this signed by the man Seth freaking Rollins, because this would be awesome to get it signed in, like, a, like, a white, like, a white color or a green color go only with this or a blue, it'd be really cool. So, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Please hit the like button, put suggestions in the comments section down below. Subscribe, share with your friends, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.